Well, an auction you will not want to miss in Leavenworth this weekend, especially if you like beagles. One of the country's largest Snoopy collections is now up for grabs. In this doggy dog world, there's ceramic Snoopy. And the arms and the legs move. Some older Snoopies. Late 50s, early 60s. Even an original drawing of Snoopy. We had just a rough sketch, and then he signed it. Charles Schultz's beloved dog found a home in Leavenworth this weekend, an auction of one of the largest Snoopy collections in the country. It's been an honor for me to sell this collection of this magnitude. Auctioneer Bruce Murphy laid out nearly 2,000 Snoopies, all of it the collection of one woman. She's known as Mrs. Snoopy in Leavenworth, Kansas. Who finally decided to let all of her dogs go for a walk. My main concern is that when it gets sold, it's, it's going, to a good, going to a good home and to a, to a Snoopy lover. But Ms. Snoopy, also known as Pauline Graber, won't be here to see them off. She's in the hospital battling health problems. It's a very difficult thing for her to get rid of. But uh, time comes in life, you realize that uh, You've got to downsize a little bit. She found the Snoopies over the years at flea markets, antique shows, and repeated trips to a Snoopy convention in California. Why does she love Snoopy so much? Well, I, you'd have to ask her that. <laughs> it took Miss Snoopy 40 years to collect all these dogs. It will take only one weekend to say goodbye. It's emotionally very draining. She's facing it. Yeah, a tough thing for her, but such a great collection. You can preview the items tonight from 6 to 8 at the C.W. Parker Carousel Museum in Leavenworth. The auctions will be held at 10 a.m. tomorrow and Sunday. Go check it out.